Hello friends, this is Bashir Ahmed Gojri, this time with a short presentation for the students of class 6th, subject history, and name of the chapter is Buildings, Paintings and Books. The world of books. In the field of language and literature, Indian heritage is unparalleled. We find Vedas, the Upanishads, the Puranas, the Mahabharat, the Ramayana and the Bhagavad Gita. Further, there are Jatakas, the Tripitakas, along with Deep Vamsa and Mahavamsa of Buddhists, Angas, texts of Jains, and the Sangam literature of Tamils. The Puranas The Puranas were written as early as 1st century BC. The Puranas are 18 in number and have 5 divisions. The fifth division is historically important as it contains the traditions about the dynasties of rulers of ancient India. For a history student, the important Puranas are the Vayu, Vishnu and the Matsaya Purana. These give us valuable information about the history of ancient India. The Epics The two epics the Ramayana and the Mahabharata give account of the social, political and religious features of people of epic age. Mahabharata talks about the war between Kauravas and Pandavas. It was written by a sage Vyas. The Bhagavad Gita, an important source of knowledge, is included in Mahabharata. The Ramayana, written by Valmiki, is about Rama who had to fight against Ravan to get his wife back. The Buddhists and Jain text Tribe Pitakas and Jatakas of Buddhism as well as Angas of Jainism give us vast information. They help in reconstructing the history of ancient India. Sanskrit works Good quality of Sanskrit literature was produced from the 2nd century AD to 5th century AD, especially under the Gupta rulers. Kalidas, the greatest poet and dramatist, enriched the Sanskrit language. His plays, Abhishnan Shakuntalam and Vikramur Vasyam are gems of Sanskrit literature. Some other major authors were Vishakhadat, who wrote Mudra Raksha, Amar Singh, who wrote Amar Kosh, and Shudraka, who wrote Mich Mricha Katika. Pajtrant was also written during this period. Tamil works Tamil is the oldest language among the spoken literary languages of South India. The earliest trace of Tamil literature is found in Sangam literature. The famous Tamil epic, the Silla Padi Karam, was composed by Elanko Adikal about 1800 years ago. Another Tamil epic, the Mani Makali, was written by Setner about 1400 years ago. Art and Architecture Ancient India achieved wonderful heights in fine arts. In the field of architecture, the Great Path and Sachi Sudupa. In the field of sculpture, Ashoka Pillars. In the field of metallurgy, the Iron Pillar at Mehroli are some great examples. The buildings built thousands of years ago were made of brick and stone. Their durability is proved by the fact that they still stand tall. Paintings and Sinus the paintings of this era are found in Ajanta and Elora. They were made of colors derived from plants and animals and were vivid in description. In Sinus, Aryabhat talk about day and night and eclipses. Some more points. The Puranas contained stories about gods and goddesses. Sanskrit Ramayana is written by Valmiki. The Durga temple at Aihul was built about 1400 years ago. 
The Vedas were recited in temples by priests and people came to listen to them. The Mahabharat was composed by Vyas and Aryabhat developed a scientific explanation for eclipses. Thank you for watching this presentation with regards Bashir Ahmed Gujari.